最近大体の日本人は教育を受けているようですねでも教育ってそんなに必要なのでしょうか今回の Ask Arthur ではこの質問にお答えします Ask Arthur あなたの英語やアメリカに関する質問にすべて答えます I got a question from one of my readers, Takashi. He says, Asa, hello. Hi, how are you doing? I usually check your lesson site. Oh, thank you. Toik te do you know this ka? Uke nakeri ba ikenai no de shou ka? Watashi wa nichijou kaiwa o master shitai no de Toik yori kaiwa o kotsu kotsu benkyo shi gai kokujin ni hana shite imas. Asa no kangai o kikase te kudasai. O nagai shimas. Itsmo yuki mo rate imas. Well, first of all, Takashi, thank you so much for your kind message. It's for people like you that I make these videos every week. Now, let's talk about TOEIC for a little bit. Is TOEIC really important? Well, like all questions, the answer is it depends. What does it depend on? It depends on how you want to use your English. The purpose of TOEIC is to measure a certain skill set of English. And because of that, people's salaries can increase or more job opportunities will open up to them if they take TOEIC. But the truth is, I know many people who have scored high on TOEIC and they can't speak English at all. Why is that? Because TOEIC is not communication. When you're taking a TOEIC test, you're not talking to anyone, you're not communicating to anyone. Instead, you're reading, you're listening, and you're answering questions. That's not a conversation. I normally teach communication, I help people use English in their everyday life. But when someone wants to study TOEIC with me, I do a completely different way of teaching them. TOEIC English and the English that I use is completely different. And it's not just TOEIC too, it's Aiken, it's TOEFL, it's all the other tests. You don't communicate on those tests, you just answer questions. Those tests measure your knowledge about English, but they don't measure your communication ability. That's why I know people who are very good at speaking English but can't do TOEIC, and I know people who are very good at TOEIC but can't speak English. Communication is not about the words you know, or the grammar you know, or the tests you've taken. It's about understanding the other person, connecting with them, sharing ideas, and you don't do that during a test. So, if your goal is to get a high score on a test so that you can make extra money and maybe get a different job, Then TOEIC is important for you. But if you just want to talk to foreigners and you want to enjoy using English in your everyday life, you don't need TOEIC. I'm fluent in Japanese, I live in Tokyo, and I failed the Japanese proficiency test because my focus is not on knowledge of Japanese words and jikugo and bunpo. I focused instead on communication. So I can talk with anyone, but I can't take tests very well. Which would you prefer? A high score on a test, or would you want to talk with more people all over the world? That decides whether you really need to take TOEIC or not. And from the sound of it, Takashi, you don't need to take TOEIC. You're doing a great job already by learning communication and using it. That's all you need to do to learn English. Do you have any other questions? You can ask me anytime on the Ask Arthur page of the UConnect website. Every week, I take one question and I make it into a video. Who knows? Maybe your question will be on the YouTube channel sometime. You can ask a question by clicking on the link up here or by clicking in the description below. Until next time, enjoy your English adventures. Bye. I can't do it. Let me do that one more time. I can't do it. 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 I know, my hair is beautiful. <laughs>